Beginning in 1980, Coach Nummel began his coaching career as the junior high football coach at Hopkins. He has been a junior varsity, junior varsity assistant and varsity assistant coach. Beginning this fall, Coach Nummel will begin his 33rd year of coaching at Hopkins High School. He was presented the Assistant Coach of the Year Award in 1998. Coach Noble's most humorous incident in coaching. Getting locked in a mental institution with another coach while asking for directions to a certain football field, all the while the players were in the bus wondering if he would ever return. <laughs> Coach Noble's biggest thrill in coaching. <laughs> Watching young athletes being thrilled by their own performance and the performance of their team. It is thrilling to watch them have fun. That, I believe, is what it is all about. Ladies and gentlemen, the newest member of the Hall of Fame, Coach Glenn Noble. share this honor with with many different people. Uh, first of all, if anybody really wants to rest of that story, see Coach Francis over there, he'll let you know the whole thing. First, I share this honor with my family. Uh, I'd like to introduce my wife, Dee. She has been uh, a big support to me over the years, and uh, I, we really appreciate that. I also share this with my daughter Megan and her son, her son. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> with her husband Brian. She has probably been one of the biggest supporters of all of us coaches when she, uh, she does police the bleachers on Thursday and Friday nights. I also uh, share this honor with coaches I've coached for for a long time. I really respect these guys. They have taught me a lot, and they're, uh, they have become very good friends. That's Rex Weaver, Jim Knoll, and Mick Francis. Stand up, guys. thanks to two gentlemen. 27 years ago, after I completed my first season, I didn't think I was going to coach high school football again. I did not have fun that first year. But a gentleman came to me and started coaching that year and said, give me one year. If you don't have fun, then hang it up. I gave him that chance. I joined him and been there ever since. Thank you, Mick Francis. Last year, along with Coach Weaver and Coach Newell, I retired. And of course, another Francis came up to me and asked me if I would coach again. And I did make that decision two months later. I had retired. Thank you, Cody Francis, head coach. share this with all the players that we've coached. We have coached uh, some good athletes and we, uh, we have coached some mediocre athletes, but we always seem to get the job done. And uh, as long as all those kids had fun, we always figured it was a, a successful season. And I would like to also share this honor with our community. I know of no other community that really supports their teams, not only the football team, more than more than Hopkins. I live in the community and coach in the community, and I can't say enough about it. Anyway, thanks again for this honor. 